welcome. Battle of the Sexes. Dun, dun, dun. Sex Wars. Yeah. It's been going on forever. It's just a friendly war. It made it exciting. Hell, we were only using blanks. But women have changed it for live rounds now. And people are getting hurt. And not just men. Quite a few years ago, I noticed these things starting to change and some laws coming in. And we having a drink with my friends, you know, male friends, and I just said to them, and they kind of laughed it off. Oh, it's only a little thing. It doesn't really affect my life anyway. I said, yeah, but it will do. And they just laughed. Well, they're not laughing now. You see, now it's affected everything and everybody. It's entwined itself into everything that we do every day, just in our normal lives. And the biggest trouble is, it's failing badly. Seems to be everything they touch, this new movement, gets destroyed. Do they admit it gets destroyed? Of course not. They're like lemmings running off the cliff. They can't see. And they try it again and again. And it fails again and again. The only result can be that it will fail completely massively all over. Because history has shown us that this type of system in civilization always fails. I mean, businesses are losing money. They try something and they lose money. So we all lose money eventually. Standard of living is going down. Costs of stuff is going up. A direct result of what they're doing. How long can it sustain itself? Well, not very long. We see that already. The laws all favor one gender. Everything seems to be favoring one gender. And that goes against nature. There has to be a balance. And there is no balance anymore. So it will fail badly. Just take a look around. See how many things around just your place is failing because of it. It's amazing how quickly they can destroy something in a matter of just a short space of time. I believe females have lost the war because they turned it into a real war. And men are built for war. Women are not. And I look around and I see how has it improved women's life, really? And it hasn't. It's made their life horrible. I wouldn't want to be a woman in the today's world. They don't have a great life anymore. Lots of men are walking away from everything because they can see the destruction happening and they know what's going to happen. It's going to fall down. The foundation is not strong enough. For war, you need supplies, a steady stream of supplies. And there isn't enough supplies. So men are just waiting it out because the supplies will run out. You can't keep failing on these things, losing money and carry on. Hopefully you guys, younger men, will be out there ready to pick up the pieces. I may not be here, but I will be there in spirit. It's amazing how it happens so quickly, though. I suppose if you think about it, you pile some house bricks up into a tower. It takes a while. It takes effort. But how long does it take to hit it with a sledgehammer and knock it all down? It doesn't take nowhere near as long, does it? But it does take a long time to clear up the mess. See you around. Bye.